Hello guys and welcome to Vestby. What's up guys, what's going on? Boris T here. Welcome to this new video. We are currently in Vestby and we are here to film this small town because it's uh, where Necrobatcher lives. This is the third time we are trying to make this video. We came here last year and I wasn't able to film anything. We tried a few days ago and my shoes got filled with water. We wanted to do yesterday but it was raining and finally we are here. A few days ago I just lost 25 fucking years for coming here and not film shit so... Please subscribe to the channel, leave a like. If you want to support more deeper, you can check the Patreon in the description down below. I have a new option, so it's cost just one euro. So thank you all. And with that said, let's go. <laughs> Guys, you have to know that uh, uh, Necrobatcher didn't live always here in Vetsby, but also he lived in Oz. We have been in Oz a couple of times and after we finish the film here, we will also go there. Something that I always find fascinating by Norwegian little towns, it's uh, when you see those little houses, you know, the typical houses that you don't see in cities, let's say, you know, and then on the other side you have apartments, like, uh, I mean, look at this. Look at this, this house here, this big beautiful house and then there's a new apartment on the left. Isn't it cool? If you subscribe to the channel I will be able to buy this house and invite you all for a coffee. But I will drink a tea because I don't drink coffees. This is the famous uh, Vespi culture school when uh, basically you learn how to play black metal and nothing else. Yeah. Did you ever see a school that looks like this? There you can see the most famous store in uh, Norway. The X extra store, it's a porn store, when you can find... No? Isn't? I bet my ass that he lives somewhere out there. I think, uh, I didn't check on the internet, but I think that um, the hen house, maybe it's not even too far from here. But of course it's private property and I will not go and disturb private properties. But if you want to invite me Necrobatcher and show me how it's inside, I'll be on my way. Some ASMR for your freaks out there. This looks like the hen house, but like uh, bigger. Seems like that they're building the center around this little neighborhood because as I said this is more countryside looking and in the middle they're starting to build you know more um, stores more apartments <laughs> Guys, look what we found. We found a bunker. I think it's from the Second World War, probably. Cool, never seen one. And I'm now just invading a property to show you how beautiful it is and that I want it. Subscribe to the channel. So guys, as you have seen, we just did uh, a really huge circle here across the town. I really like this place actually. Didn't think at the beginning but it's really nice, especially this part here up there. Wow. <laughs> 
Now we are going back. We are going back and we are going to Oz, where Necrobacher lived before. There is a nice story that I have to tell you when we are in that place. Let's go. It's lunch time. This is the problem when uh, you film outside, you know, and you're a cheap bastard. So we have bread, we have vegan cheese and vegan salami behind. I'm dying. I'm gonna eat food in here, you piece of shit. I hate you. I... Holy. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Holy. Fuck you. Do you, you! do you know why why I fart so bad, guys, today? Because you're a bitch. No, shut the fuck up. So she brought those <laughs> chickpea chips, like, they're so healthy, it's for you, you are a healthy freak. I'm like, okay. Oh! I oh know. my fucking god! <laughs> and I took the package, I opened it, was the worst smell ever, smell like sulfur or something like this. It's us right now. <laughs> it's a fucking chip. And uh, I tried just one, just one, and I immediately started to feel bad. So I checked the date and it was written before February 2022, best before. And she was like, oh, don't worry, when they write best before, it can last forever. <laughs> yeah, sure. I called you for Hi guys, we finished to eat, we are in Oz, and I will show you a little bit of Oz. Let's go. You have to know, guys, that a couple of uh, days ago we went here, you know, and the Norwegians say, oh, you can't imagine how much times I got drunk there with my friend. And then she wanted to be funny and she say, oh, do something, go there, you know. I think those footprints are mine. Probably, yeah, those ones are mine. So I went there, but had my 10 years old boots and I fill it with water. Yeah, so basically we went a couple of days here to film that and after five minutes we have to leave. Nice. I have a new boots. That lady ordered for me. I still have to sell them their money but... Yeah, still have to. the famous Norwegian talking tree. Rumor says that even Medjugorje have it. Guys, filming in winter, as I already said in Norway, it's damn tricky. Just go, just see on the ground. It's crazy. And it rained for two days and still is full of snow and ice. By the way, we are in uh, Ols Open Gym. This guy is, is famous because uh, it's where uh, Hellhammer put all his muscle on with Necrobatcher being his trainer. How you think uh, Necrobacher? Oh, sorry. How you think uh, Hellhammer put all those muscles? Here you have the answer. Okay, guys. Compared to uh, Netsby, Netsby. Compared to Vestby, this one is a little bit more developed. I, I prefer Vestby, to be honest. So about the story that I want to tell you about uh, Os, you have to know that uh, a friend of the Norwegian were the best friend of uh, Necrobacher's daughter. And one day they were coming back home and they found, they opened the door and they found Necrobacher laying on the ground aiming with a uh, air rifle at mice, saying, I will get you, motherfucker. That's the story that uh, this girl told to the Norwegian and considering that uh, she was the best friend of uh, Euronymous, uh, Euronymous, <laughs> Necrobacher daughter, I think it's, uh, there's good chances that uh, it's true. You don't know shit. Fuck you! Now we are going uh, to the station, close to the station, just to show you that part of the city too. So this is the station. It's very similar to other Norwegian stations, of course. And uh, it's very similar to Langus station when they did uh, the famous picture. Actually, the Norwegian just told me that uh, she thought that actually was this one, the station, when they did the picture, Euronymous and uh, Necrobacher. Now I think
think uh, for those small um, places that we have visited, I think maybe my favorite is Vespi. Here? You like it more here? Why? I just know it better. Ah, okay. It's been okay. Here since I was 15. Are you used to hang out here? Yeah. With okay. My, me and my black metal friends. Ah, okay. We're a big, big group of metalheads. Yeah, this little place? Yes. Crazy. Can I ask you where you were hang hanging out here since I don't see any pubs or places? There was a pub, uh, it's over there. And then we were in that place, the arena that you saw. Oh yeah? And then up in the mountains, the mountains, uh, forests. Okay. So there was a pub here, there right? Oh, okay. I threw up like a pig there. It's a metal pub or normal pub? Normal <laughs> pub. Local. Okay. But we never went to the pubs, we always went to the forest. So as you can see guys, we are on the other side. We have the station right now there. And look how cool is this. We have the station, the buildings there, and behind her, there's a cute house. It's just no sense. So guys, by the way, a lot of you asking me about uh, my band Trigla when I will release new merch. And uh, the new merch finally this year, I'm just wearing one of those right now. This is the Plague Pixelated Plague Doctor t-shirt. It's one of my favorite for the new collection. If you like it or if you want to check also the other t-shirts, just take a look in the description down below. You will find the North America store and European store. I try to keep the prices as low as possible, so Take a look. Oh, I forgot to tell you that all the t-shirt designs, photoshop work, etc. was done by my friend Tops Design. You have probably seen him in few of my other videos. If you need some help with your merch, your website, etc. don't hesitate to contact me. Link in the video description. So guys, as you can see, we are a little bit out of the center, so there's no point to continue. There are just houses and road. So we are going back. I will show you just a little bit there. And then we are going back to Moss because uh, it's freezing, as you can see and uh, she also is dying, so let's go. Sorry guys, people recognize me and also. It's hard to be a celebrity. As always, I do the best parking ever. Guys, by the way, we are in the end of the video. I don't know how this video came out. I hope it came out well, but it's seriously really cold, really hard to record in this weather. So, if you enjoyed this video, remember to subscribe, leave a comment. It's really important. With that said, this is all. Boris here, signing off. Bye. Satan. <laughs>